John chapter 10. The really amazing thing about John the Baptist was how empty he was. I mean empty of self. In himself, he constantly decreased. Although I think the best way to describe what happened to him would be to say that he constantly sought to assist in the increase of Jesus at the expense of himself. Such a dynamic personality would not be focusing on the negative, but the positive. Now this is amazing. He had no interest outside his mission, and his mission was to prepare the way for the Messiah, to identify him when he arrived, and then to fade into the background. Even before he was born, he was responding to the Messiah when he leapt in his mother's womb when Mary entered the house. John was absolutely sold out for Jesus, to use the modern expression. Now, it would have comforted him to hear people say, John didn't do any sign. But all things that he spake of this man, Jesus, were true. He never performed a miracle, not one. And that suited the man who wanted all eyes to be on Jesus. He had instructed his disciples that when the Messiah arrived, they were to leave him and follow Messiah. And this is what happened. The disciples of John acknowledged the Messiahship of Jesus on the strength of John's word. John had known a touch of Jesus even before he was born, and there's so much to learn from that man. Contentment in serving God right where he has placed you is one of those things. John had it in abundance. He didn't get anxious about no miracles in his life or the fact that his disciples were leaving him. He had one task, to herald the Messiah, and he was content to do that job and do it well. What was his secret? His spirit was in touch with Jesus. His single-minded mission was to serve the glory of Jesus. That's all he wanted. Anxiety and discontentment can be a sign that we still want some glory for ourselves, you know. We get anxious because we feel we should be somewhere else. Jesus taught us to set up camp wherever God leads us. When his disciples were welcomed into a home, they were not to search for better digs. They were to make the most of every situation, every relationship, every day, believing that God had arranged everything, even the troubles. In other words, it was enough to be close to Jesus. That's all John concerned himself with. That was his secret. And that's our secret.